Another example of how thieves are out of control in Albuquerque, only this time it's not a car, it's flower pots decorating a front yard. And the thief doesn't look like a meth head with a long record, she looks like a soccer mom. Here's News 13's Marissa Lucero with the video. Dean, the woman says instead of calling police, she's using social media first to see if anyone out there recognizes the thief. You know, you can't help but kind of laugh about it. Tammy Hansen got a chuckle out of the fact that her husband has resorted to nailing a bench into the gravel and chaining a piece of wood to the ground in their front yard. But she says he has good reason. Some Talavera pots that I have had, <laughs> and I noticed that they were missing. It happened last Thursday, and it was all caught on camera. Just snatched him right up. After Hansen reviewed the surveillance video, she noticed an SUV drive by her Paradise Hills home around 5 in the morning. A couple minutes later, it came by a second time. The third time, it stopped at the stop sign, turned its lights off. Looked like they had, had cased the home. And made its way in front of Hansen's home. She didn't seem to be in a hurry. She um, almost acted like those were hers. In workout clothes and her blonde hair pulled back, the thief never even tries to cover up her face as she raids the yard four times, loading each of the Talavera pots into the back of the SUV one by one. I couldn't believe it. I mean, I would think that if somebody is going to take something that they would at least try to disguise themselves. Definitely not someone that you would typically think would do something like this. Hansen posted the video to Facebook hoping someone would recognize her. The same route an archery shop owner last week took when he says a man made off with a thousand dollar crossbow. Hansen says she thought before calling police she'd try to get a name to go along with the video. I'm hoping her employer will know that you have a thief working for you. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and so that's my whole thing. And but yes, I'd like them back. Hansen says each pot was worth around $200, and all four of them were new. Back to you, Dean. All right, Marissa, thank you. Hansen says she plans to file a police report this week.